saved him a small fortune in medical bills. Channel 4's Erica Rako joins us live. He had travel insurance. I mean, I, every time I see that option, I always click no. Absolutely, but this man says it saved him tens of thousands of dollars. John Palumbo now living in assisted living facility after a horrible accident overseas. He's thankful he had chosen to get that travel insurance and encourages any of you traveling anytime soon to look into it too. There will never be another bad day for me. There will be a never be another bad day. Not after this. This was this ranks right up there with traumatic experiences. It's hard to have another bad day after going through what John Palumbo has. He was pickpocketed in Africa and fell and broke both shoulders while chasing after the thief. Palumbo says he's so thankful he's going to make a full recovery, but is even more thankful he had travel insurance. Good Lord, thank goodness I got it. I mean, I can't. I don't even want to fathom the thought of what it would have taken to get home without it. Palumbo says to take this advice coming firsthand. Anyone who goes more than a few miles from home, even if it's just once a year, needs to get travel insurance. All you got to do is look at me. I'm sitting in here with two busted arms. I have zero capability of moving for the next month or two. And I got home safe and sound because I had traveler's insurance that got me here. Palumbo says it saved him tens of thousands of dollars. It provided a skilled nurse who was by his side within hours and took care of him until he made it home to Jacksonville. Even as, you know, weird as I look in all these braces, I still feel very good and I see the light at the end of the tunnel and I'm looking forward to a full recovery. Palumbo says in looking for his own travel insurance, he realized there are several different options for you to purchase coverage if you're going on vacation anytime soon. Again, he stresses to definitely look into this. It saved him a lot of money and got him a nurse to stay with him all the way until he returned back here in Jacksonville. We're live this morning, Air Carreco, Channel 4, the local station. Yeah, because as you can see, he can only move his hands for the next couple of weeks. Thanks, Erica. Who's in rehab?